read the red, Luke 13. Suppose ye that these Galileans were sinners above all the Galileans, because they suffered such things. I tell you no, but except you repent, you shall likewise perish. Or those eighteen upon whom the tower and Siloam fell, and slew them, think ye that they were sinners above all the men that dwelt in Jerusalem? I tell you no, but except you repent, you shall all likewise perish. A certain man had a fig tree planted in his vineyard, and he came and sought fruit therein, and found none. Then said he unto the dresser of his vineyard, Behold, these three years I have come seeking fruit on this fig tree, and find none. Cut it down, why cumbereth it in the ground? And he answered and said unto him, Lord, let it alone this year also, till I shall dig about it, and dung it. And if it bear fruit, well, and if not, then after that thou shalt cut it down. Woman, thou art loosed from thine infirmities. Thou hypocrite, does not each of you on the Sabbath loose his ox or his ass from the stall and lead him away to watering? And ought not this woman, being a daughter of Abraham, whom Satan has bound, lo, these eighteen years, be loosed from this bond on the Sabbath day? Unto what is the kingdom of God like, and whereunto shall I resemble it? It is like a grain of mustard seed which a man took and cast into his garden, and it grew and waxed a great tree, and the fowls of the air lodged in the branches of it. Whereunto shall I liken the kingdom of God? It is like leaven, which a woman took and hid in three measures of meal to the whole was leavened. Strive to enter in at the straight gate, for many, I say unto you, will seek to enter in, and shall not be able to. When once the master of the house is risen up, and has shut the door, and you begin to stand without, and to knock at the door, saying, Lord, Lord, open unto us, and he shall answer and say unto you, I know you not, I know you not whence you are. Then shall you begin to say, We have eaten and drunk in thy presence, and thou hast taught in our streets. But he shall say, I tell you, I know you not whence you are. Depart from me, all you workers of iniquity. Then shall be weeping and gnashing of teeth, when ye shall say, Abraham and Isaac and Jacob, and all the prophets in the kingdom of God, and you yourselves thrust out. And they shall come from the east and from the west, and from the north and from the south, and shall sit down in the kingdom of God. And behold, there at last which shall be first, and there are first which shall be last. Go ye, and tell that fox, Behold, I cast out devils, and I do cures today, and tomorrow, and the third day I shall be perfected. Nevertheless, I must walk today and tomorrow and the day following 
for it cannot be that a prophet perish out of Jerusalem. O Jerusalem, Jerusalem, which killed the prophets and stones them that are set unto thee, how often would I have gathered thy children together as a hen does gather her brood under her wings, and ye would not. Behold, your house is left unto you desolate, and verily I say unto you, ye shall not see me until the time come when you shall say, Blessed is he that comes in the name of the Lord.